Let's get into our talkers for today. All right, so first thing first, the vintage Jeep might have an impressive movie resume. Okay, iconic auctioners say it is auctioning off a nearly 80 year old Old Willie's Jeep that it says was featured in the movie's Band of Brothers and Saving Private Ryan. Now this Jeep was first registered in the United Kingdom in 1977. It belonged to three owners before receiving a full engine rebuild earlier this year. The auction group says the vehicle was first built on the U.S. Army as a go uh, anywhere vehicle. The Jeep is expected to sell for more than 19,000 bucks. I am a Jeep girl, so I think that I could probably, I would get this. I would get this if I had, if they take it, um, finance, it would be mine for sure. All right, moving on. In Minnesota, the Como Park Zoo and Conservatory in St. Paul has welcomed a new baby giraffe. I lived in St. Paul. The calf was born uh, Monday night and has yet to be named. All right, so this is the third calf born to seven-year-old a uh, Zania and a ginger has not been confirmed. So according to the zoo, the calf was already standing next to its mother less than an hour after birth. Now this baby giraffe is now the fourth member to uh, the zoo's herd and is expected to make its public debut in the next few weeks. If they need a name, name it Pearl after me. I mean, why not? I'm just saying. And all my coffee lovers out there, congratulations. Today is National Cappuccino Day, uh, observed every year on November 8th. This traditional Italian coffee beverage consists of espresso, heated milk, and steamed milk foam. But in the age of Starbucks and designer coffee, the cappuccino has been spiced up, literally, with all sorts of additions. Okay, I'm not for this. If you guys love coffee, this is your thing. Um, this year, this time one of the most popular add-ons appeared to be, of course, pumpkin spice. But the cappuccino can be customized in countless different ways. You know, the drink takes its name from the cappuccin. I hope I'm saying that right. Uh, the beverage's color resembles that of a rich brown hoods, and the robes, which have been removed, revealed uh, their white shaved heads. Super cool, super cool. So if you're around Starbucks today or Dunkin', go ahead and get you a cappuccino. All right, those are your talkers for today, people.